all, welcome back to Mystical Skies, and we are in the nether, and you can see just how crazy the nether looks in this mod pack. This is all uh, the better nether mod, which I, I've got to say, I haven't found a lot of information on. And one of the things that we need, uh, so I've just picked up a black apple, which is this thing here, you can sort of see, I've got it, I've, like my inventory is full, there you go, black apple, we needed that for some reason. And then this, the ink bush. And this was important um, because we need that to start Britannia. Uh, I don't know what it does, but we do need it. So is that another one? Ink bush? Yes. That. Oh, that's just grown. Let's have a look. I need to. I need to. I need to get rid of some stuff. So let's just do that. Let's see what happens when I. There we go. We got what three of that? And what? What do we do with this? I have no idea. Oh, we smelt it to get ink. Ah, okay, and now I wonder, can we, can we pick it up? Is this a thing that we can like, no, it doesn't look like it. Okay, there we go, we've got eight now, fair enough, okay, well there we go, we've got some of that, so we've got, oh, we've got three quests done. Now someone said as well that we can, ah, there you go, unclaimed rewards, look at that. I didn't even notice that at any point. Look at that. So thank you very much for that. So uh, I will... Uh -oh. oh, no, it's okay. It's just a pigman. We're okay. I will meet you back in the overworld uh, as I struggle to get back there. We're not that far away. Um, but I realize that this is very dark here. So, yeah, I'll meet you back in the overworld. We are back. We are back here. How's everyone doing? I hope you're all doing well and having a good day. Now... Last episode, we we hit a bit of a bit of a you know a brick wall basically, uh, and I just couldn't figure out how to get ice, and I'm still still not sure. I've got a potential solution. Obviously, Inkbush, we are we're going to try and get a little bit of Britannia done. Someone mentioned that the amplifying tube uh, uh, and glass will do a thing, but it doesn't. That's been there for quite a while now. It doesn't do a thing just so that people know. Um, and the only way I can sort of see uh, doing it is to get snow from Britannia. So that's what we're going to try and do. So let's have a look. So food crate, obviously, that is... Oh, we've got some cheesecake. Uh, so floral fertilizer. Let's try and find out how to make that. Oh, grass I need because um, of that. So let's make some grass. There we go first. There we go. And I'll be interested to... To figure out how this works i mean it's just one of those things because this is a very new type of mod there's obviously not a lot of um not a lot of stuff on it uh oh mysterious fertilizer we've got two of and there we go that's why look at that we needed we needed this so eight of that lovely stuff uh let's do that um that is a book isn't it and a sapling normally uh hang on hang on hang on there we go. Looks oh yeah. Oh, so we can use any of the books. Okay, that's rather great. Um no, that's there we go. Oh, and let's use an orange one because we've got loads of those. And a sapling. There we go. Lovely stuff. Lex Capitania. Thank you. Thank you. Let's do that. Uh minus stew. Top tier food. Always edible buffs player. Um Okay. Oh, wow. I mean, 13, 13 haunches, 31 saturation. That's a little bit crazy. Um, I need to just dump all of this stuff in here a little bit. Uh, okay, done that. Next, we have petals. It doesn't say how we get the petals. Now, the pure daisy is the one that we I, I want um, because that's the one that we need. Uh, without that, we, we can't really do very much. Pure daisy is where it is at. So I don't need to go very far. I don't need to go far in Britannia in order for this to work. Just a little bit. Just like a tiny amount. So, what I'm going to do... Let's set this up here. Oh, look at that grass. That is lovely. So bright. I like that. Uh, where is our floral fertilizer? Oh, I couldn't see it because I had a bush there. Okay. See, I wasn't sure if that dropped that. Maybe. Maybe it does. I do not know. I do not know. Uh, can we put this down? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. We can. Black bush. You would think, wouldn't you? I, I'll see. We'll let that go. So, okay. So this is obviously how you get uh, these. Oh, man, I want, I need a white. 
A white petal. Oh, I'm getting like everything but. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, come on, please. <laughs> okay, this is. I'm sad. I'm sad. Last one. <sighs> of course not. Of course not. So I've got to do that again. Um, we can do that again. That's fine. Uh, I need mysterious, mysterious paste first, or no, mysterious fertilizer. Let's put in floral. Um, nope, floral. There we go. I can't remember how to make that. Stone dust and mysterious dust. That's not too hard. Mysterious dust. There we go. Bam, bam, bam. And then bam, and bam. There we go. Another eight. Another eight. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Yes! Yes. So now, normally, well, and not normally, but you can duplicate. Um, but obviously, you need bone meal. And I don't think I have, like, any way of having bone meal right now. Oh, there is. There totally is, actually. Uh, we can get a bone block. Ah. Bone block uh, from one of these. Ah, so that's what glass does. There you go. Rock core and the shard of the born might and gets us that. And that just means that once you have one flower, you can basically start copying them, um, which is a rather grand. Obviously, I've got all of this, so I can keep going for the second. Might as well just use all of this now. There we go. Got another one of those. Thank you. And another one. Oh, of course, now, now we have one. We keep getting them. Uh, and I think there are 16. There should be 16 different flowers. So it's like one each of all of the colours of Minecraft that you can have. That's how it works. And last one. There we go. Bam and bam. Lovely stuff. I don't know how many we've got. Hopefully we've got all of them. So, I very much need more chests, don't I? Long-time watchers will know that uh, this is the time that is very dangerous for, for old Ector because um, basically it just gets worse and worse and worse. And I've got nothing to... I've got literally nothing, can I? I don't know why, but all mod packs, they always seem to want to gate, like... Or at least learn. <laughs> Look, that's how far down refined storage is. Um, what was it? You need to start, uh, complete the nature powders and mana powder quest, which I don't even know what that is. We have simple storage, though. And what do I need to do for that? The mana powder quest. Right. What is the mana powder? That is mana powder. Right. So, that is basically usually gunpowder or redstone uh, in order to get mana powder. So, okay. That's not too far off. We could maybe try and get some simple storage stuff going as well. Um, but yeah, I find, I find it weird that, you know, that's one of the things that is always gated uh, for, you know, like mid mid to late game. Like, why why not give it earlier? Give it earlier. So, uh, ah, this is what I was doing. This is what I was doing. Let's get a few of these. Whoop. Uh, let's make that. There we go. Right. Let's get up here. Of course, of course I do that. There we go. Right. Come on. Come on, Hector. Concentrate. Bam, bam, bam. Right. So, that, that, all of this. You, 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 you. And we should just need, to begin with, four of these. And we need at least four other colours. There we go. Lovely. Now I can come down. There we go. Right. How are we doing on the old questage? We should have, we should be one further down. There we go. Petals, yes. Build a crate. And now, petal apothecary. So I think we need stone for that. Uh, possibly slab. Possibly cobble as well. Let's just get it. Let it, get it both. Thankfully, I know a little bit of Britannia. You know, I can, I can just about get by with my knowledge. Um, what is it? Slabs. Oh, it's cobble slabs. Okay. You keep. There we go. Bam. So not stone, or is it? Yeah, not stone. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't be using that. Use use those. There we go. Petal apothecary. And now the next one is pure daisy. There we go. Right, have I got seeds? Now then, I can't even remember. Ooh. 
Oh, okay. So, <laughs> so seeds are the next thing. Can we? Is there a way? Oh, yes, there is. Look at this mutation paste. <gasps> and getting wheat gets the seeds. Okay. 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 That is that is rather exciting. So mutation paste gets us various things. So mutation paste there. And how do we make that again? Uh, fertilized essence and mysterious dust. Okay, so we can we can make more. If should we choose? Should we choose? Uh, so that seeds like that. Excellent stuff. And what I'm gonna do? If I can find a bucket, do I not have a bucket somewhere? Clay bucket. Yes, that should do. That should do us. There we go. I will, and I don't know if this will work. No, it doesn't look like it. That doesn't do it. It does work for glass. The obsidian, what is it called? It's obsidian displacer. Totally works for glass. Look at that, you can see. Which is rather great. Not for grass. Glass, yes. Glass, not so much. There we go. Uh, let's do that. And then I'm... Oh, I shouldn't actually tilt these. What am I on about? Because that removes the grass bit. Let's not do that. Let us not do that. That is silly. Silly actor. I will set up a little, a, another little area, just using dirt, and just so I can get some wheat, so that we basically then have a way of always having seeds, uh, and I don't have to make more. Right, there we go. Got a little, got a little farm now. Got some more seeds, so we can always get that at the most. Now you always want to put a petal apothecary next to some water because you will need to, uh, and then. Drop four of those bad boys in. You can see we need a seat, and we get that. So we could make another one of these, but actually, right now, I don't. I don't really need to. I do not need to. So I don't think I can pick this up. Uh, sadly, I don't want to pick it up just in case I lose it. So and we're already, already, already getting like so, <laughs> so, um, like cramped for space. I do need to. I need to actually at some point make it bigger again and do I have where's the bag where's the bag of stuff gone uh, yeah so I have some more arcane stone I think I'm gonna have to go away from arcane stone at some point for building purposes because obviously I, I've got a finite amount of it uh, so once we get a little bit more stuff done I'm gonna actually start building out properly and giving ourselves just a little bit more space just to make things look a little bit nicer there we go got some got some of this so so, so, so. Uh, I need the merest hint of space right now. So I need one dirt. I, I want some cobble. Let's just use cobble for now. Um, so let's put you there. Let's do that there. And then... Uh, we need basic... Now then, how am I going to do this? Because surely that will wash that away. If I put water there, will it not? Yes. So can I can I put it like this? Is this the thing that I can do? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Yes. So you can see that is working on that. So obviously if I put it there, it would wash the pure daisy away, which is sort of, you know, sort of defeats the point a little bit. Uh, but this should give us snow. Now with snow... What we can do, uh, let me show you, snow block, there we go. Uh, if we get coring recipes, we can get sea lantern. And with a sea lantern, we should be able to get prismarine shard, and with prismarine shard then, uh, we should be able to use that in the coring recipe to get lapis. This is, this is my hope. I don't know, but this is my hope. This is the plan that I've concocted as like literally one of the only ways I can see how to do this. I do think, I will say, I do think there should be a little bit, like just a little bit more of a, you know, nudge in that direction. Because I can't, I've got to say, I can't really see it. Um, like it's a bit weird here that it just like, I don't know, it just sort of stops and then says, oh yeah, make this thing that I have no idea. But anyway, that's just me. There we go. we got snow. Excellent. Right. Uh, I'm going to make... Uh-oh. Did that not do it? Oh, no. Can I not pick snow up? Does that literally not do a thing? <gasps> Don't tell me that does not do a thing. If that does not... If I'm not able to pick this up, maybe with the obsidian displacer? Okay. Well, this could all go wrong. We're all good. 
There we go. Got some living wood. So, I don't know why, but if I, you do it with a shovel, then obviously you get snow. It's all fine. We're okay. We're okay. So, um, I need now, I need my flint and steel, which I've no idea where I've put. Uh, no, that is not it. Flint, flint and steel? Do I, do I not have my flint and steel anywhere? Oh, there it is. There, I should be able to spot that, shouldn't I? Um, so... Let's put, I see some more shards there. So, apparently, we'll get a warm core by igniting this. Um, igniting this with flint and steel. Okay, and there's apparently... <laughs> apparently, that's how that works. Uh, where's that? I don't know where that goes. That goes there. There we go. So, now, um, we are able, or we should be able... Shall I just put it here? There we go. Uh, we should be able, basically, to get to get a prismarine lantern. Now I don't know how this is gonna go. Are you doing a thing? It is that, isn't it? Oh, I haven't done. I haven't done this. There we go. I'll tell you what I need. I need my bag. Let's get that for the magnetism. It's a weird system, this, that it pops off. I haven't really got used to it, if I'm honest. There we go. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Please do this on camera. There we go. There we go. Right. So, get that back. Get you back. Now. Does this work on this? No, it doesn't. Okay, so I'm really, really hoping, like super hoping that I get some prismarine from this, because if I don't, I don't know how I'm going to do this. Great. We just literally got crystals. So, that set back aside, uh, I'm making a living rock bonsai pot. I don't know how this works, like at all. I don't really, uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, let's see what we need to put in here. To make this a thing, uh, I don't know where to put this. I've made a, a crafting station as well. We've now unlocked that, uh, which is kind of cool. Let's maybe put you here for now. Um, how I don't understand living rock bonsai pot. How does <laughs> I don't know how that helps. Uh, requires living rock. Do we do we put more living rock in to make this work? Like surely. And then what? It, like, to me, uh, that suggests that we can make that from that, but maybe not. Maybe that's, maybe I'm completely incorrect. It just seemed like, surely, that is a bonsai pot that you can, I don't know, like, why is this a thing? I don't really understand it. Botanic bonsai. Yeah, sure. Oh, maybe, is it for, like, things like this? No, I have no idea then. I have absolutely no idea. So, okay, fine. What I am going to do, though, what I've sort of noticed, so mana pool, there we go. What I have noticed is this thing here, a snow flower. So that should be able to generate mana. So what I reckon is we can use our pure daisy to turn something into snow, then use the snow flower. Oh, it's not here, obviously. Um, oh, no, no, keep that on. Use the snow flower to generate the mana. Uh, and basically, mana powder seems to open up uh, a lot of things. I think it opens up... Uh, yeah, mana powder opens up simple storage. I think it also opens up a bit of this as well. Uh, yes, there you go. Ender IO mana powder. So that would, I think, actually... I think it's worth us doing that, getting trying to get some mana powder. Um, so that's what I'm going to try and do. Now, let's just check. Let's just check. Oh, it stopped raining. Excellent. Mana, pow. Let's just check. Um, redstone. Yeah. Ah, and glowstone. Oh, easy. Easy peasy. And in fact, loads. Sugar, floral, any powder. Okay. So plenty of stuff. So I'm going to go uh, ahead and do that. I've made some bone meal. I made a bone block. So that I can copy some of these because I'll need them for the ma uh, no snow flower, snow flower. 
light blue and three white so light blue have i got yes yes i totally do excellent so i had to end up going with endo flames because these don't do what i thought they did which is sort of like the endo flames take coal and you know turn that into mana these basically and this is from botanic editions so i, I looked that up uh, and there's a few others as well like the rain flower and the lightning flower and obviously as these two suggest uh very much so it only it only makes mana when it is snowing um or raining or lightning with those other ones so obviously that does not work so i've just done the very very standard uh, in the flame thing that i basically always do that was i was hoping to maybe try something else but uh, this is one of the easiest ones. So that is an open crate with a hopper pointing inwards. And there is a pressure plate there. And basically you put you put in so anything that burns. So you can put in charcoal as well or coal or wood. Anything that burns basically. Uh, and these will convert that into mana. And basically that's just what you do. Uh, and that just means that basically anything that gets put in the open crate falls onto there whilst that pressure plate is activated this is locked so it doesn't you know just keep dropping stuff basically that's how that works and then this boom mana powder look at that that is the oh wow and that is ah look at that wow so ender io is open simple storage is open mystical crops is open tiny farms is open solus and refined storage oh, okay so maybe that isn't, that isn't all the way over there, but okay, cool. There you go, that's all we had to do. So still worth doing. Um, still, still then don't. Um, I've got another potential possibility of how to get, how to get this, how to get ice. There is another thing now that I'm, I'm thinking maybe we can do. Um, but other than that, I still have no idea. So that's still, that is still ongoing, but... But that is like a lot of progression, really opening up all of these things as well. So I'm I'm happy nonetheless doing a bit of a Tanya. Always good. So thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you're still enjoying the series as much as I am struggling. Um, I've been Hector. Uh, if you like it, do all of that stuff and subscribe if you fancy. And if not, that's okay. Maybe just watch and that is okay as well. I've been Hector. This has been Mr. Pascaz. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>